What's up YouTube? It's your girl Rochelle. Thanks for tuning in to another video. Can you believe it's already time for November? I can't. It's what? crazy. It's so crazy. Anyway, we are here to do a budget for November 2020. Now, just so you know, it's not our budget. It's not our budget. We are doing another budget takeover. If you don't know what I mean, feel free to look at the eye in the sky and watch how our October budget takeover went. Which, which way you One of these sides over here? Can hey, you point that way? Okay. And I'll point this way. It's up Eye there. in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, Asia Sierra Budgets, which um, is our girl Asia mm -hmm. on YouTube, she volunteered her budget. But guys, this time it's a little different. We are doing a Battle of the Budgets! <laughs> so this means that she will receive two budgets for the month of November with all her numbers plugged in and she will choose which one she wants to use for the month of November. So tune in to her channel to find out which one she chooses. So here we go. We're spitting our option. Here we go. with This is what we would do with Asia's money and her budget if it was us. Okay. So first up, Bull, her income totals for the month of November, she's set to bring in $2,806. So we got a nice amount to work with. I, mm -hmm. So first things first, I have my Every Dollar app, y'all. Let me pull it up because Every Dollar is, is how we doing this. So Every Dollar is free. If you're not familiar with it, it's a Dave Ramsey inspired app. Check it out. Okay. So for the month of November, the first thing we wanted to do was pay all her bills, you know, slate all her bills that she has to pay that are unchangeable. Non-negotiables. Non-negotiable. So first up is Chase. Chase has a minimum of $150 that she must pay. So boom. Chase. Yep. Done. We'll be back to Chase later too. Coming back for you. Coming back. Next up is USAA. So USAA is getting $350. That's not changeable. What's the USAA? It's a, a bank for uh, federal or military, I want to say. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, I remember the commercials now that you mentioned it. Okay, sorry. Sidetrack. Next up is AT&T. AT&T is going to get $72 for the month. Next is FPL, her light bill, Florida Power and Light. They're getting $150. Next are her monthly subscriptions. So that's probably like all her Netflix, Disney Plus, all that type stuff. Hulu. It's, yeah. That's going to total $60. And it might include some of her YouTube stuff too. Like she might oh, yeah. use like Pick Monkey or Canva or something like that. So that totals $60. Last but not least are her sticker subscriptions. So she has Gilded. And their monthly subscription is simply, I think it's simply gilded. And their monthly cost is $30 a month. So once you take all of that off the table, now we have these other buckets to fill. So first up, how much are we going to put into savings? Now this is just her regular savings. She already has her emergency fund. So now we're just going to decide how much extra we're going to add to that. So we're just going to put $100. Just a hundred. Okay. Just a hundred because no. she's already got her emergency fund and we know that Asia cares most about Chase. She wants to end the year, y'all, with Chase gone. And we want it for her. Okay. So savings is just getting a hundred. Next up are her savings challenges. Now we love challenges. So she is doing the envelope savings challenge and the 52 week savings challenge. And for that, we are allocating, allocating $300, girl. Live your savings life. Because right. if it's one thing Asia cares about after Chase, paying Chase off, is savings, honey. Okay? So we want to make sure that she is not stressed and your savings is taking a huge amount. Next up, are her cash envelopes. So you guys watch her cash envelope videos. You know how she don't play about her cash. So total cash envelope money, not including food, we are allocating $350. 
$350. Now, this is for everything cash except for food. So, that would be... Oh, go ahead, boo. Oh, and no, I was going to say, what are her cash envelopes? Oh, her cash envelopes are gas, allowance, household, Amir, her baby boy, mm -hmm. their baby boy, and giving. So those are the categories. So we figure she, so Mike, I had said an amount that was less than three fifty. Let the people know why you came up with three fifty, Mike. I said, well, I said to add a little bit more for like her, hopefully for her personal allowance, because I feel like doing budgets, a lot of people don't give themselves enough personal money, and I think that's a budget breaker because just some, a lot of times there's something that you want, but you don't have uh, enough allowance for it, and you break your budget. So I think it's enough to have enough personal spending money. Even if you don't spend it all every month, you can roll it to the next month. Or if you don't spend it at the end of the month, you can roll it into your savings or to pay a bill. But it's enough. I think it's important to have enough play money. Boom. And it depends on what type of person you are. If you're a natural saver or a natural spender. If you're a natural spender. She's a saver. She's a saver. So she might be all right with less. But. And if she has extra left over at the end of November, she can just boom. Put it where she wants to. Yeah. That's the beauty of it. So, yes, yes. That's your money, Asia. That's your money. Mm -hmm. So, we talked about the regular bills. We talked about the savings challenges, the savings, the cash envelopes. Now, let's talk about the other thing she spends cash on, and that's her food. So, if we go up to groceries, we originally said $600 because we looked it up. How much do they say you're supposed to spend per person on groceries? I think they said 250 per adult for a month and 150 per child. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. I feel like I've been looking up here the whole time and I'm supposed to be looking down there. I know. I've been going back and forth. Sorry, y'all. We are still adjusting to camera <laughs> life. Anyway, we decided on $500 for groceries for the, a family of three. That's Anthony, Asia, and Amir. Oh, they all start with A. Oh, sure enough. I just realized that. Oh, that's, that's crazy because we always say A for Adamson. Yeah, we always say A for Adamson. A for Asia now. A for Asia. A for <laughs> Anthony. A for Amir. Because we are always first every time we go somewhere and it's like an alphabetical and it's always like... <laughs> it's a good and bad thing. Anyway, 500 for groceries and $100 for eating out. They don't eat out much. Asia tends to stay in the house. She's not playing about this pandemic. <laughs> I understand. Mm -hmm. So just in case, <laughs> just in case, yeah. you got a total of $600 for food now it's time for the big reveal how much is left to put towards chase baby we are getting rid of chase we are doing our part mm -hmm. to get rid of chase so all the money that's left is going to the chase debt snowball and that amount is <laughs> Six hundred and forty-four dollars. Six hundred and forty-four big ones are going to your chase if you choose our budget. Mm -hmm. And we say that. Who are we up against? We're up against Tanisha. Mmm. <laughs> We're coming for you, Tanisha. <laughs> Stiff competition. Okay, and I'm, I hope that she doesn't watch this until I think the way we have it worked and set is so that we won't see each other's video until the day that we all release them same time. That way Asia can reveal and tell us which one she chose. Okay. But anyway... You might notice that something is missing. There's something that we did not mention, and that is her federal loans. Mm. Normally, up until the pandemic hit, she had been putting all her extra money toward federal loans. But now that there's a pandemic hold, I don't know for lack of a better word, they are deferring interest and payments. And so or not even deferring, like that you don't have to make any payments and you're not accruing any additional interest. So this is the perfect time to look at some other debt that does have high interest mm -hmm. and knock that out first. Yeah. So federal loans just got, and <laughs> Chase just got bumped up. <laughs> Um, boop, boop, boop. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> so that's what we would do. That's our November battle of the budget. That's our submission. Yeah. And we hope, Asia, that you choose us. We, we you know, we got your A for Adamson, A for Asia. Yeah, see? 
See? <laughs> but either way, you are all set because you have your own budget. You have our budget as an option. And you will have Tanisha over at Fun and Budget yeah, Act yeah, yeah. to choose from. <laughs> so that's three good budgets right there. You yeah. are so <laughs> <laughs> Tanisha, that was Micah. That was not me. That was not me. Anyway, I am so excited to see how it's going to go. Which budget she will choose. Which budget do you think Asia will choose? Oh, oh, okay, okay. I was, okay. <laughs> I was a little bit, you know, I wasn't confident for a minute. We think that Asia's gonna choose A. Yeah. A for Adamson. A for Asia's budget. <laughs> <laughs> it just it, makes sense. It makes sense. But either way, she's set because I know Tanisha's not going to play about that debt either. We know right. Asia's goal is to start 2021 with no chase. Yeah. Well, that's all for us. Thanks for tuning in to another video, and we will see you guys in the next one. Peace, love, and, and budget. Oh, oh, yeah, and budget. Oh, I'm later. Aloha. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Bye. Like and subscribe. Yes, do that, please. Because I always forget well. to say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that helps the YouTube algorithm so much. Mm -hmm. A like and a subscribe. If you if you like what you saw today and you want to see more of it, then go yeah. ahead and just hit that button. Go ahead. Okay, we're gone for real this time. We gave you time. Bye. I did Astro again. Do your Astro again. I messed it up last time. Peace, love, and budget. Aloha. <laughs> <laughs>